Hi, I'm Minister Ralph Friedrichs. Making a difference is my belief. Here's my challenge to everyone. I just want to challenge everyone, a challenge I'm also trying to live out. No matter how busy you are, there is always something you can do to brighten someone's day. Give someone a hug. Send a text with an inspiring quote. Friends, mail a heartfelt card. Tell someone how much you appreciate him or her. If we look, each day presents us with opportunities to share kindness throughout the world. My core belief that we are called to not only love God and love people, but to carry out the Great Commission and share the eternal message of Jesus Christ. My goal is to help you reimagine your life and let go of the thoughts and behaviors that undermine you so that a renewed and fulfilled you can emerge starting today. We must love one another as God loves each and every one of us. To be able to love, we, my friends, need a clean heart. Prayer is what gives us a clean heart. The fruit of prayer is deepening of faith, and the fruit of faith is love. I hope each and every one of you remember to show compassion and have a, a great life ahead of you with Jesus Christ. Good morning. My name is Ralph Friedrichs. I am an author, an addiction recovery coach, a life coach minister and host of this show to take your life back today radio show you can see a video version of this if you go to youtube under our channel take your life back today show this is an iHeart radio itunes google music amazon music and other digital formats friends you might be trying to control your um your timing you might be trying that all the time but god is calling you to trust his schedule god is a healer and he specializes in restoration but it rarely happens how and when you, my friends, expect it. If you need to be set free in a specific area of your life this particular year, then this message is for you. We all face challenges in life. We all have storms in life. The key is to rise above the turmoil. Don't let it uh, uh, get on the inside. You don't have to fight through it. Remain at the rest area of life. Keep your seat and God will fight for you with your battles. Too often we're fighting when we should be resting. We are standing when we should be sitting. Yes, friends, I know we have to stand strong. But in your spirit, even though it may be stormy, things you don't understand, things that aren't fair, you need to have faith that God is in control of you and your life. He is fighting your battles and he's bigger than what you're facing, no matter what the problem might be. Our Lord is a huge, big, awesome God. Call me day 44405. Help together you and I. We can help each other take our lives back. Be good to yourselves. Always be good to each other. Remember, a simple smile to anyone can change their day. It can make a difference in your day as well. Remember that our God is so big, no matter how big or small your battles are, God will get you through that storm. Have a great day. May God bless each and every one of you and have a great life with Jesus Christ in your life.